There is an old saying that says, this is why we can't have nice things. As of yesterday, the ATF, the fire, the agency for which was part of the tax department, has decided to go after the humble, innocent airsofters by banning airsoft pyrotechnic grenades. And you think I'm joking on this, but I'm not. You can find the web, you can find it in the pinned comment down below of everything, the open letter straight from the horse's mouth. All the pyrotechnic grenades that we love and we love to use in airsoft at our Milsim events, at pickup games, things like that, now are illegal. And you need a license for it. You not only need, of course, a regular FFL, but you also need an FEL license. You also need a destructive device. All that paperwork, basically, that says, hey, you can own and use explosive devices. But now, the airsoft devices, i.e. the Enola Gay smoke grenades, the Enola Gay pea grenades, which are basically just firecrackers with dried peas inside them, the tagging grenades, all that stuff, are now considered illegal under ATF regulations. Even though, last I checked, this stuff has to be passed through the legislative department of the government. This has to be passed through the judiciary department of the government. The fact that the ATF has decided to basically come after Airsoft, and, and mark my words, mark my words, this is only the beginning. Soon enough, we're basically going to see them then start cracking down on other elements of Airsoft, claiming that, oh, this is dangerous, uh, not only for uh, the public and the possibility of uh, property damage or anything like that, but also because of uh, possible uh, criminal activities. Even though we have fought back time and time again against this. Have there been instances where pyrotechnics have started fires? Yes. But we've always contained them. We've always been able to be on top of it, and we've always been able to keep it from spreading. Have there been moments where cold start smoke grenades have caused some small burns? Yes. But we've always been on top of it, and we've always stopped it. I fear for the future of Airsoft. Because I love this sport. This sport has actually, this hobby I love, has actually helped me find new friends and actually helped me expand my creativity. I do not want to see it go away or disappear. Which is why it is very important for people to know and to understand that we we're good people. Yes, we do joke around, we do this, but this is just... Pin comment down below so you understand what's going on and you get a full scope of what's happening. Till next time.